She's a feared MMA grappler who is always ready to fight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, accompanied by Ronda Rousey from Sioux Falls, South Dakota, the Queen of Spades, Shayna Baszler. This woman will tie her opponent up in knots. You're right about that, Cole. Shayna Baszler is so confident in her abilities and her knowledge of this game. Well, who can forget Baszler's incredibly dominant run as NXT Women's Champion? I'd just like to send my condolences to anybody whom Shayna Baszler sets her sights on. Is it just me, or does Shayna sometimes seem mean-spirited? They call that killer instinct, Saxton. And trust me, it's a good thing. Byron, time to put your hair up and square up. Well, you don't have any hair, but you get the point. And her partner from Shalom, New Jersey, Sonia DeVille. Oh, here's a cunning opportunist. Careful how you speak about Sonya Cole. She happens to have a very gifted mind for this business, both as an official and from bell to bell. She's a powerful striker with a very extensive mixed martial arts background. Yeah, Sonya Deville never pulls her punches, but does like to pull strings behind the scenes. Now, been a recipe for success for her at times, though. One of the best women strikers in WWE, Nikita Lyons. From Las Vegas, Nevada, Nikita Lions! Already a favorite of the NXT crowd. It won't be long before the entire WWE Universe catches on. Play from Lions. And I think we'll see plenty more of that in this match tonight. Oh, 
a battle-hardened veteran and one of WWE's toughest women. And from Paris Island, South Carolina, Lacey Evans. I'm kind of surprised she didn't make us do her entrance twice. Well, it's because you're just like the WWE Universe, Saxton. You are giving Lacey the respect she deserves. Listen, I'll give her respect. Yeah! But I still think she has an attitude. The sassy Southern Belle is gone, gentlemen. You are now looking at a woman possessed. Tag team rules here with Shayna Baszler and Sonya Deville. And in the other corner, they will be dealing with the Keita Lions and Lacey Evans. We have to be expecting a frenetic pace in this matchup. These teams stop for nothing. They are all go from bell to bell. Oh! Tag! This precision teamwork. Just like that! To the spine. From the middle rope. Oh, what a splash. Looking bad for her here. Rapid shots right to the gut. Vicious, aggressive attacks. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. So she tags in. Looks like Baszler is psyching herself up. Slam tagged in. So in the middle, connected with a solid shot. Now tagging her in. Oh, look at Shayna Baszler. Strike after strike after strike. So dangerous. Look out. Slowing now. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. And Nikita capitalizes there. Oh, ouch. Boom. Head first. Right across the knee. He'll get locked in. This is painful. They need to be aware of a count out right now. That gets reversed on Nikita. Eat the feet. Tag. Comes out on top in this tag team match. And here's another quick look at those superstars in action in that tag team battle.
Here are your winners, Shayna Baszler and Sonya Deville. The ref completed his count, and we have a winner. Not the win they wanted, but it's a win nonetheless.
The following contest is a six-woman tag team match. On the way to the ring, Bailey, Dakota Kai, and EO Sky. Damage control. The feeling, the electricity in the arena right now is unlike anything I've ever felt in quite some time. This match yeah. is going to be good. Here comes the queen, Charlotte Flair. A woman who has truly done it all in WWE. And their opponents, first from the Queen City, Charlotte Flair. She is a game changer, a trailblazer, and perhaps the greatest woman to ever set foot in a WWE ring. And with all of Charlotte's accomplishments, some say she's already a living legend. She's had rivalries with Lynch and Rousey and revolutionized the industry. When your last name is Flair, competing is like breathing. And the Queen has built an empire. No false bravado, always personal, always physical. Yeah, and always maintaining supreme confidence and savage ferocity. Charlotte Flair proudly pulls the strings as the puppet master of the women's division and will gladly accept anyone who will bow down. She created her own divine right as the queen and intends to cause great pain and suffering to her opposition. You just can't game plan for this type of brilliance. One of the most popular competitors in the women's and division. From Elmwood Park, New Jersey, Liv Morgan. Guys, Liv Morgan just living out her dream here in WWE. Yeah, Liv's career has just really taken off. Became Miss Money in the Bank and then successfully cashed in the contract to become SmackDown Women's Champion. Raquel Rodriguez, a massive presence in the women's division. And from Rio Grande Valley, Texas, Raquel Rodriguez. Think about the incredible resume of Raquel Rodriguez. In her first three years, she's been an NXT yeah. Women's Tag Team Champion, a Dusty Rhodes Classic winner, an NXT Women's Champion, and a WWE Women's Tag Team Champion. Look at her physique. Look at the size of her back. Well, Raquel Rodriguez also has a great personality. Even though every time I ask, she won't share her workout tips with me. That's okay, Saxton. You couldn't survive Raquel's warm-up. Here we go again. Three-on-three -three action underway now. Ouch! Wait a minute, setting in, devastating submission coming. Oh, Bailey's dreams about to end here in this match. Oh, 
save just in the nick of time. That's how you wear down your opponent. Crank in the head. Look at this, Byron. With your forehead, Sable draining all the energy. There's the save. How close was that? for each other. Hit drop. I've been waiting to see that. She gets the tag. Lock it in. The dragon sleeper. Oh, Bailey dreams about to end here. On this. No, 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 no. Teammate in to save the man. Not over yet. Yes, he did. In a six-woman tag match, your strategy has to be different than a regular tag match, doesn't it, Corey? While there's certainly an added advantage with a third woman on your team, the fundamentals of a strong tag. Over here! And she towards the pin attempt in one. She is still in this fight. And a tag there. Slam! That kick will stop me in your tracks. Got the front face lock applied. Nice suplex. A oh, dragon screw ankle breaker into the ankle breaker. And she finds an answer to Charlotte. Ooh, she hit the corner hard. Oh, what impact! And this is just a vulgar display of ruthlessness. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Tag made, she's in. Able to get there in time. Some big hits here. Now Ooh. Parker tags in. Big form. Reversal. What a counter. You only got one. Last shot. Oh, nice balance. Tag her partner. Catching a drop kick. Rodriguez with a nice turnaround. Oof. Tag made here. Oh, this is going to be bad. And a hammer fist right across the collarbone. Oh, 
Reigns got an answer for that. Closing this one out. And set right into the corner. Yeah. Couple hard shots there in the corner. Now looking to raise the stakes. Head it up. Corkscrew center. That's gotta be it. <laughs> and Raquel Rodriguez with an epic. Whip. She's going up. Top rope here. She's getting back to her feet. But is there fight? Lion. Diving in her strike. Sharp elbow with a gut turns that one around. in off the tag. Hurricane Rana. Unbelievable athleticism. Oh, God. Here's a tag. The switch here to show it. Charlotte Flair has her trapped. Oh! Backpack star! Bailey avoids the assault. Close to ending it all there. Oh, what a kick. Ooh. Just caught a flush. Charlotte Flair stepping into the figure four. Can she complete the bridge? 
to the figure eight. Charlotte Flair can taste the... And there's the save. Charlotte demanding respect from her subjects in attendance. Turnbuckle's the only thing keeping her upright. The Queen teeing off. Making the climb all the way to the top. Charlotte Flair moonsault. Yes! Second chance worked out for the Queen. Figure four locked in. Charlotte going to look for the bridge. Figure eight from the... I can't believe that she is going to counter it. Great win with all. The WWE Two. Universe willing these superstars on. Pumping the adrenaline they so desperately need right now. Chocolate. Brilliant. Right to the back of the name. She might be zoned in on the leg at this point. She's able to get the tag by the skin of her teeth. Genius of the sky showing up a little bit for the folks on the ground. Yes, tag. Close line. Off with their head. Ooh. To the back of the net. Sky shipper. Starting 
to show signs of being outmatched here. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Looking some of the action from that match. Wow. spreading like a wildfire. The electricity in this arena is almost palpable.
Here comes Prime Alexander. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Charlotte, North Carolina. Weighing in at 200 pounds, Cedric Alexander. Well, Cedric Alexander's had a lot of ups and downs in his career, but I admire the heck out of him for committing to a new career direction. Now, Alexander's held the Cruiserweight title, tag team titles, but tonight, Cedric looks for even more success. Cedric Alexander has proven he can compete at any level in any type of match against any superstar. So you better be ready. The gold standard of WWE. And his opponent from Orangeburg, South Carolina, weighing in at 248 pounds, Shelton Shelton's an athlete with ridiculous ability and extremely resourceful. Bottom line, Shelton Benjamin knows how to win. We are looking at a next level athlete, a true hybrid competitor. And Shelton Benjamin is dangerous, whether in a faction, tag team, or singles action. You know, guys, I like this new attitude of Cedric Alexander. He really seems to be having fun in the ring now. He's his opponent and he is out look at uh oh to the floor. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. No! Tompe, what? That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. talk about Cedric Alexander, we focus on how well-rounded he is as a superstar. As his opponent, it has to be hard to find a hole in his game plan. Right, Corey? It might be hard, Cole, but it's not impossible. You need to stifle his speed and agility, and the easiest way to do that is to out-muscle him. It won't be easy getting your hands on him, but once you do, you can't let go. He is not going to let him make a mockery of things. Lots of potential for injury here at ringside. These superstars better be careful. The floor, the barricades, our table. None of these things are fun to collide with. Boom! Shelton gets intercepted. Gets inside the ring. You never see that coming. Stop to finish it off. Shelton Benjamin keeping the pressure on. Out muscling Cedric right now. And if he keeps Cedric in his grip, he can do it here. Almost. Oh, if the ref was only in better position, that would have been three. position with your feet tied up like that. Yeah. Ah, he's got that boot right up against his face. Come on. Oh, and soon we could be seeing a submission here. The 
submission hold, straining the ligaments of the back here. What a unique submission. How do you get out of this? Oh, look at that. What a great counter. speed and that's the versatility of alexander paying off heading up he's thinking back what a crash landed oh my gosh that don't stop anybody Shot right to the kidney, and again. Great way to wear down your opponent. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Oh. Trapped in the corner, no escape from these punches. of confidence pouring out of him right now. Oh, Good night. And Cedric can't stop any offense coming his way. But Cedric's just one. Oh, my God. You see that height. Shelton's got that intense look in his eyes. Nothing Cedric can do now. We got our money's worth for that one. Take a look. Here is your winner, Shelton Benjamin. He really got the better of the opposition here. I agree, it was quite the display tonight. The Queen City's favorite son will never break through if he keeps collecting losses. Well, you know, this ominous tune is just a prelude to the toll of man. A competitor with seemingly no weaknesses, no fears, and here he is, carrying cross.
Just a prelude to the unrelenting attack we are about to see from Karrion Cross. Here comes the monster of all monsters. And his opponent from Sheryls Ford, North Carolina, weighing in at 385 pounds, Braun Strowman. Think of all the titles that Braun Strowman has won throughout his career. Tag titles, intercontinental title, even the Universal Championship. More interested in causing destruction and running over the competition. Expect the worst because the monster is about to be unleashed. WWE Universe, brace for impact. When Karrion Cross gets in the ring, he always seems confident that it's only a matter of time until he's standing over his opponent victorious. In Cross's mind, he's something of a human doomsday clock, just counting down the seconds until he delivers the obliteration of his victim. It's a ruthless mindset, but it's brought Karrion Cross plenty of success. While the clock is ticking on this match, we'll see if Cross is able to exact his apocalyptic plans in this one. When you're standing across the ring from a monster like Braun Strowman, you are looking straight into the eyes of a man with absolutely no conscience, no regard for the things he's about to do to you. Strowman is as competitive as he is aggressive. A dangerous combination by any stretch of the imagination. Big time hammer fist. A little insult to your injury. Cross boasts an impressive physique, but what's the best way for him to utilize that power tonight? Cross needs to mix that strength with ruthless precision. By making targeted attacks, he can use all that muscle to debilitating him. And what he's looking for here looks like a potential submission maneuver coming. And the other set of there. But will he be able to last much longer? Cross just advanced the count on the Doomsday Clock with that attack. One after another. Karrion Cross just toying with the crowd now, too. He manages to escape it. To the outside. This could get wild. Close line. Good lord. So effective. Devastating elbow. Uh. Impact in the corner. Oh, what a knee. One step ahead of Cross. Big time hammer fist. Setting it up. Thunderous clothesline. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Uh-oh. Cross fires back. Braun has been cut down. He's pushed to the break. Through the 
the clothesline. What impact! Carrying Cross, watch this power. F10 with the F. Shoulders down. Incredible, absolutely incredible. Big time hammer fist. He's finding himself in trouble here. Yeah, this is a dire situation right now. And Cross evades that. Ooh, what a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. He went right into that turnbuckle. Big splash in the corner. He's taking this to the floor now. Whoa. Looks like he has his finger on the trigger now. Two. Yeah. Oh, the counter. Three. Setting it up. Yeah. Boom. Yeah. Caught with a clothesline. Cross trying to get into his opponent's head. Need to hustle back to the ring. Just a few seconds left. Oh, man, by the skin of his teeth. Jeez, what a way to make us sweat. That catches Cross looking. Braun has him up. Running power slam. Boom. Braun should show mercy and just end it. And here's a look back at some of the action from the previous match. Here is your winner, Braun Strowman! He really wanted this one bad. Yeah, what a major win for him here. He was as on top of things as he could possibly be here tonight. And look how it paid off.